Today back then, what happened today in modern history? Let's get most smartest. In 1737, American writer and political essayist Thomas Paine is born. In 1743, French Cardinal André Hercule Fleury dies. In 1781, Mozart's opera Idomeneo premieres in Munich. In 1796, running from York to Lake Simcoe, Yonge Street opens in Toronto. In 1802, John Beckley of Virginia is appointed the first Librarian of Congress. In 1819, British East India Company Administrator Sir Stamford Raffles, that's a great name, anyway, he established the Port of Singapore. In 1820, King George III of Great Britain dies blind and insane at Windsor Castle. In 1834, U.S. President Andrew Jackson orders the first use of federal soldiers to suppress a trade union labor dispute. In 1839, Charles Darwin marries Emma Wedgwood. In 1845, Edgar Allan Poe's The Raven is published. In 1850, Senator Henry Clay drafts the Compromise of 1850 to defuse tensions between slave states and free states over territories won during the Mexican-American War. In 1856, the Victoria Cross is established to acknowledge bravery by the British government. In 1860, Russian physicist Anton Chekhov is born. Also that year, American College was established in Rome by Pope Pius IX. In 1861, Kansas is admitted as the 34th U.S. state. In 1863, the Bear River Massacre occurred. Hundreds of native Shoshone men, women, and children were killed. In 1879, the Custer Battlefield National Monument in Montana is established. In 1886, German engineer Carl Benz patents the first gasoline-powered automobile. In 1891, Ili Uokolani is proclaimed the last monarch and only queen regent of the Kingdom of Hawaii. In 1896, Emil Grub is the first doctor to use radiation treatment on breast cancer. In 1900, Professional Baseball's American League of Baseball is organized in Philadelphia with eight founding teams. In 1905, Tsar Nicholas II of Russia, unsettled by the rising violence and protests, enacts reforms to improve the conditions of workers. These changes will do little to stop disorder throughout Russia in ensuing months. In 1907, Charles Curtis of Kansas becomes the first Native American United States Senator. In 1908, the Alpha Pi Alpha Fraternity at Cornell University incorporates. In 1913, Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority at Howard University incorporates. In 1914, U.S. Marines land in Haiti to protect the U.S. Consulate. In 1916, Paris is first bombed by German Zeppelins during World War I. In 1918, actor John Forsyth of Charlie's Angels and Dynasty fame is born. In 1919, the U.S. Secretary of State announces the 18th Amendment prohibiting alcohol. In 1920, Walt Disney starts his first job as an artist for $40 a week in Kansas City. In 1924, the ice cream cone rolling machine is patented by Carl Taylor in Cleveland, Ohio. In 1929, the Seeing Eye Dog organization is formed. In 1933, German President von Hindenburg totally blows it and appoints Adolf Hitler Chancellor of Germany. In 1936, the first list of members of the Baseball Hall of Fame, known as first inductees, are announced. They include Ty Cobb and Babe Ruth. In 1944, 285 German bombers attack London. In 1953, the first movie in Cinemascope, The Robe, premieres. In 1954, Oprah Winfrey is born. In 1958, movie actor Paul Newman and actress Joanne Woodward are married. Also in 1958, murderer Charles Starkweather is captured by police in Wyoming. In 1959, Walt Disney's Sleeping Beauty is released. In 1963, American poet Robert Frost dies. Also that year, the initial list of Pro Football Hall of Fame inductees are announced. In 1964, the Beatles record I Want to Hold Your Hand and She Loves You in German. In 1966, a snowstorm in the Northeast kills 165 people. Also in 1966, Sweet Charity opens at the Palace Theater in New York City 
for 608 performances. In 1967, the Mantra Rock Dance takes place in San Francisco. It is considered to have been the major spiritual event of the Haight-Ashbury hippie era. In 1969, Britain is refused entry into the European Economic Community. Also in 1969, Jimi Hendrix and Peter Townsend wage a battle of guitars. In 1975, the first annual Comedy Awards of the Year, hosted by Alan King, was broadcast. In 1978, Sweden is the first country to introduce a law banning the use of aerosol sprays harmful to the ozone layer. In 1979, Brenda Spencer kills two, and in doing so, she inspires the Boomtown Rat song, I Don't Like Mondays. In 1980, actor and entertainer Jimmy Durante dies. In 1982, Wayne Garland, baseball's first millionaire free agent, is waived by the Cleveland Indians. In 1983, the song Down Under by Australian group Men at Work hits number one on the UK pop chart. In 1984, President Ronald Reagan formally announces that he will seek a second term. He wins. In 1985, Britain's Oxford University refuses to award British Prime Minister Margaret Thatcher an honorary degree. In 1986, scientists in Nova Scotia report the largest fossil find in North America. 100,000 pieces of bone belonging to dinosaurs, reptiles, and fish are discovered. In 1988, Canadian Ben Johnson breaks his own 50-yard dash world record at 5.15. Also in 1988, a United Airlines Boeing 747 SP circles the world in 36 hours, 54 minutes, and 15 seconds. In 1990, the Exxon Valdez Captain Joseph Hazelwood goes on trial in Alaska due to the worst oil spill in U.S. history. In 1991, the Battle of Kofchi, the first major ground engagement of the Gulf War and its deadliest, begins. In 1995, the San Francisco 49ers make NFL history by winning their fifth Super Bowl. They defeated the San Diego Chargers in Super Bowl 29 by a score of 49 to 26. In 1996, France stops nuclear testing just one day after testing a bomb in the South Pacific. Also in 1996, the 23rd American Music Awards are broadcast. Garth Brooks cleans up and Shania Twain is named Best New Country Artist. Also in 1996, the 6,138th performance of Cats is held in London, surpassing the Broadway record of A Chorus Line. In 2000, Carl Malone of the Utah Jazz becomes the third player in NBA history to score 30,000 career points, behind Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, 38,387, and Wilt Chamberlain at 31,419. In 2002, George W. Bush coins the term Axis of Evil as part of his State of the Union address. In 2006, the U.S. Postal Service releases a 39-cent stamp featuring Hattie McDaniel in the same dress she wore in 1940 when she became the first African-American actress to accept an Academy Award. In 2009, Illinois Governor Rob Blagojevich is removed from office following his conviction on several corruption charges. In 2012, American snowboarder Sean White achieves the first ever Super Pipe perfect score of 100 in the Winter X Games. In 2013, SCAT Airlines Flight 760 crashes near the Kazakhstan city of Amalti, killing 21 people. In 2014, archaeologists discover the oldest Roman temple from the 6th century BCE at Santomo Bono, Italy. In 2015, Australian novelist Colleen McCullough best known for her sweeping romance, The Thornbirds, dies at age 77. Also in 2015, Malaysia officially declares missing flight MH370 was an accident. In 2018, the Cleveland Indians MLB baseball team announced they will remove Chief Wahoo logo from their uniforms in 2019. Also in 2018, Marvel film Black Panther, directed by Ryan Coogler and starring Chadwick Boseman, premieres in Los Angeles. Also in 2018, the Toronto police arrest landscaper Bruce MacArthur for murder after remains of at least five people are found in potted plants at his home. In 2019, Toronto landscaper Bruce MacArthur admits in court to the murder of eight 
young men. Also in 2019, Tehran, Iran bans dog walking in public and driving with dogs. In 2020, U.S. President Donald Trump signs the United States-Mexico-Canada Agreement, a North American trade agreement that is meant to replace NAFTA. And in 2021, proposal to prevent the feminization of male adolescence is published by China's Education Ministry. It asks Chinese schools to use sports to cultivate masculinity. So you know you want to watch more of my videos. There's some right there. Do it. Go ahead. Go ahead. Do it.